for if from x consider the following values the net profit margin is 10% the return on asset is 12% financial leverage is 2.5% cost of equity is 15% cost of debt is 10% and marginal tax that is 40% now my return on equity will be turned on asset into the financial leverage so it will be equal to 12% into 2.5 that is equal to 30%. Now, if the firm intends to achieve a sustainable growth rate of 15%, the maximum dividend payout ratio which the firm can offer is so the sustainable growth rate that is G is equal to the retention rate into ROE. And my retention rate will be given by 1 minus dividend payout rate that is DPR into ROE. So, if I have to uh, if I have to maintain, if the firm has to maintain a sustainable growth rate of 15%, then the ROE is 30%. In that case, the maximum dividend payout ratio, my maximum DPR will be 50%. So, if my dividend paid per share is more than 50% of the earning per share, then the firm will not be able to achieve a sustainable growth rate of 15%. However, if the dividends paid per share is less than 50% of the earning per share, then the firm will be able to achieve the sustainable growth rate of 15%, 15-15%. So, in this case, the maximum dividend payout ratio which the firm can offer is equal to 50%. So, option B is the correct option.